Westy on Productions. Yo, so what is going on guys? My name is Vortex and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel. Now in today's video, I'm showing you guys the brand new MOC to MOC gift cards to friends pitch. Now I've all been waiting for an MOC to MOC version because the facility one has been a right pain in the ass. So if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video, a like down below would be highly appreciated and please subscribe if you have not already as I upload daily GTA 5 online videos just like this one. And also, I just want to ask you all, why is the crew on GTA still looking so dry? We're going to have to have words soon because it's an on. With that little rant out of the way, let's get on to today's video. Alright then guys, so there's a few things you need to be made aware of before you start this glitch. You need an MOC with personal vehicle storage in Bay 3. And you also need a vehicle warehouse, but you do not need a special vehicle in there. Now your friend... He needs a special vehicle warehouse, but he does need a special vehicle in there. And yours too's special vehicle warehouses cannot be the same. Then what you want to have is your MOC parked near or outside of your friend's vehicle warehouse. And then you just want to jump in the car that you don't care about as long as you know that there's a free energy in the back of your MOC. So now all your friend is going to do is jump inside the car and he's going to enter his pause menu. And all you need to do is drive up to that blue dot hanging out the back of your MOC and you want to press right on the D-pad and accept the alert. Now your friend's going to get kicked out of your car. All you want to do now is reverse a little bit and move it out of the way. Now what your friend wants to do is invite you into his CEO. Once you've accepted, just have him request a special vehicle. Now it can be any special vehicle as long as it's come from the vehicle warehouse. My friend's got out of Ruina 2000. So now what you want to do is walk up to the car. You do not want to run. I've heard running can fuck the glitch up, so do not run. Walk and get in the car. And then my friend is just going to drive into his vehicle warehouse with his interaction menu up and you're also going to have your interaction menu up. Now when your friend knows your interaction menu's up, he's going to get rid of his. It will eventually kick you out of the car as it's done in the video. So what you want to do now is go into CEO and just leave his CEO. Now from there, just open up your interaction menu and request your MOC. Once your MOC has landed and you see it on the map, go into interaction menu and go into the RC Bandito. Now, if the you quit bit is still up on the screen, wait until that has come off because I kept trying this. I've tried this about five to six times and it would not work. And then I realized, let me wait until this you've quit the CEO has come off the screen and I did and it worked. So if it says you've quit that CEO when you're in the RC Bandito, just wait until that is gone. So once that you quit notification has gone away, press triangle to exit the RC Bandito. Now when you spawn in, you should see your character will start flashing just like mine was then. So what you want to do from here is have your friend go and retrieve your MOC because you can't leave this area now. So have him go do your dirty work for you and tell him to go get your MOC. While he's getting your MOC, you want to walk back towards your friend's special vehicle warehouse, just like I am in the video. Because remember, I've heard running messes it up, so I just didn't want to risk it and run. Now what you want to do is have your friend take cover on the back of your MOC. You want to hold down on the D-pad, press up to go towards the story character, and then decline the alert. Once you've declined the alert, go into the blue circle on your MOC and simply click enter alone. So now what you're going to see that's happened is you're going to be on an infinite black loading screen. So now what your friend wants to do is he wants to jump into a streetcar and head to Spanish Avenue. Now if you don't know where that is, I will put up a picture on screen now of where Spanish Avenue is. Now, once your friend gets to Spanish Avenue, what he wants to do is call out the car that you want. For me, it's this Izzy. Now, once he lets you know that he is in position and the car is there, what you want to do is hold down on the D-pad and do the story mode thing again and decline the alert. Now, what you're going to see is you're fully invisible and you will be in Spanish Avenue. So all you want to do now is run to the car as fast as you can. And as you get to the car, do the story mode thing again and decline the alert and jump in the car and then you'll be teleported into the back of your MOC and the car is now yours. So with this glitch guys, you can get anything for free. You can get helicopters, planes, special vehicles. You do need to own standard versions of the special vehicles if you want to get modded ones with F1s or Bennies, but you can get free cars, so make the most out of it because I don't know how long this is gonna last until Rockstar patch it. But as always guys, if you did enjoy today's video, a like down below would be highly appreciated and please subscribe if you have not already as I upload daily GTA 5 online videos just like this one. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Peace out.